So now let's see how we can work around with the reverb effect inside of Audacity. So to work around and apply the reverb effect, I'm going to go around over here on the top and then click on the record button. So this is the audio that I'm going to apply the reverb effect in. So there you go there, you got the audio and then a bit of space so that I can hear out the reverb effect. So in order to apply the reverb effect as you're speaking in a stadium or something, you have to select the audio range of where you want to apply the reverb effect in. So you can select this and then if you were to go around into effect, then you can see reverb is here. So once you click on reverb, then this, you, this is what you have. You can increase out the room size right here. You can go for delay right here as well, damping and everything else right here. So if you were to press OK, then this is what you have. Re you have the reverb effect. And if I were to go around and then play this. So this is the audio that I'm going to apply the reverb effect in. You can hear out that the reverb effect has been applied according to how we uh, actually worked out. So uh, that is how you can apply the reverb effect inside of Audacity. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.